Illnesses like the flu have a special shot made to prevent it, but when it comes to young kids, one common virus does not have a vaccine. First News Weekend Morning anchor Abby Schrader joins us live in studio now to explain some ways to prevent the spread of something called RSV. Abby? RSV is otherwise known as respiratory syncytical virus, and it's on the rise, especially this time of year. And it's especially worse for kids under four and for babies. And because it's such a common virus, there are some things all of us can do to prevent the spread of it. Now, it's highly likely that every child will be infected with RSV at some point. Symptoms include coughing, runny nose, sore throat, and fever. And sometimes, kids can end up in the hospital for treatment. And because RSV is so contagious, all it takes is a simple touch to spread the virus around. Dr. Leroy Eberly of Akron Children's Hospital says there's one simple thing all of us should be doing often to prevent RSV. Good hand washing is always the key for preventing these wintertime viral illnesses when the parents are either going between their older children and taking care of the baby or really just any time they're going to be handling the infant. Dr. Eberly says hand sanitizer will work too, but he says proper hand washing is the number one preventative step that we should all be taking. And it is possible for a child to get RSV again, but symptoms usually aren't as bad the second time around. Now, if you head over to our website, WKBN.com, I'll post some more information about RSV, things like symptoms and the treatments. Live in the studio, Abby Schrader, 27 First News this morning.